just wanted to fill you in. Um, today has gone to shit already. My alarm has not been gone off, so I'm an hour and a half late. Um, I have chemical burn on <laughs> my face, um, which I'm having a job to cover up because it's scabby and it's just clinging to the foundation. So I just look like a monster today. Um, and I can't find my bra, so um, I'm braless. So it's, it should be a Monday, not a Thursday. The good news is that Grandad's home. Um, they have put him on steroids, which is awesome. Um, I have been telling the doctors he needs to go on steroids for absolutely ages, um, and they've just not done it. So, but now they've put him on steroids for his lungs. This should be m a massive improvement for him. <clears throat> Sorry, my chest still isn't very well. Um, I've had a COVID test, which is negative, by the way. I don't know if I told you that. So, yeah, all's well. Um, they've upped his morphine uh, by a tiny bit. So I'm hoping that he's going to be okay and stabilise um, because that needs to happen. He can't get any worse. If he gets any worse, he's, he's got no place to go. He's got, he can't go any lower. Um, but his oxygen levels are still really well. Um, and I've learned that people with COPD and pulmonary fibrosis actually learn to live in a hypoxic state, um, which was quite interesting. I've been doing loads and loads of reading um, all about this, um, what he suffers with. In actual fact, I do have a surprise. Da -da 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 -da! So I have been given a stethoscope. I've been reading all about how to do it. I've had some training on it. Um, and I can now listen to my grandma's chest and establish if it's getting any worse or if there's more fluid there. Um, so I could just uh, straight away, I'll be able to sell. So this is something that I've added to my obs kit. Um, and he loves it. He's like, Dr. Deandra. And I'm like, Grandma, I'm not a doctor. <laughs> not a doctor. Um, <laughs> but it's uh, it's quite great. It's really interesting, actually. Uh, I was listening to Charlie's lungs, and they are amazing. And my lungs go because <laughs> I've got asthma at the minute, which is really flaring up horribly. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, all's good. We're on the up. Um, just got to get Grandad better. Oh, and uh, he came up with a new diagnosis, actually, uh, which is a bit <sighs> oh, long-term chronic COVID. Um, so his symptoms have now been put down to COVID. Um, I mean, what a guy, 101, two lung diseases, uh, a kidney disease that's in your vital organ. Um, and he catches COVID, gets over it in three weeks and he comes home and he's, he, it's just incredible, isn't it? Um, I, I think he's an absolutely fantastic, fabulous person and his resolve, his, his perseverance, his determination is just beyond incredible. Uh, I've not seen it in anyone in my life. But so I went to visit him last night and he was tucked up in bed, all nice and warm. He's like, shall I have the heating on? I said, no, Grandad, because it affects your chest. Just, just hang fire. I said, are you warm enough? He said, yes, I'm warm enough. So I tucked him up really nice and tight and cozy and he's okay. But his GP surgery, it seems to be shite. Um, it, all, it makes a really big difference if you've got a good GP. Um, I'm really happy with my GP. I love my GP. Um, and unfortunately, Grand is in Clay Cross and can't be under that GP. So he's got to be under the one that he's on. Um, he's doing really well. He really is. I'm, I'm super proud of him. Um, he's not giving up. So yeah, I'm happy about that. Grandad. Say hello. Is it dressing gown? No, it's not a dressing gown. It's a mm. camera. Mm. Wave. <laughs> I don't know why he said that. He's having his cup of tea. <laughs> Quick video, because I'm really, really late. I managed to get in every single slow lane that there was. Um, I'm having my lips corrected. As you can see, there's more on that side than that side. Really, really quickly, because I'm super late. Um, and I can't wait to get it done. Um, so I'll see you with the results soon. Oh, look what you made me do. Look what you made me do. Here we go, guys. I've had a little bit more in the bottom. Um, at the minute, it's still quite swollen, so it does look a little bit odd. And I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> bit like a sex doll. But when the swelling goes down, it'd be much better. Um, I am I am really happy with them. So don't worry, I'm not going to go any bigger. Um, not till next year. I go every year and each year I get that little bit bigger. 
little bit bigger, a little bit bigger. Um, but honestly, he's so fast and so accurate. Um, oh, it's, just, it's fab to just watch watch someone's mind work. Because um, he said, oh, is it, is it is it naturally asymmetrical? I said, yes. Unfortunately, you got a little bit of a challenge. <laughs> um, I'm never an easy case, am I? I have got eyelash glue on my head. That's not gonna come off.